Ladies and gentlemen, today is for another day of Tesla Watch Along Takeover Tricet. And guy, yesterday for day one was crazy. We've been watching, of course, to kick off with Justin the Tiger in the fifth. Absolutely amazing movie. And then after that, we finished out with watching Wolf and Chibi for the third season four. We want to thank you for Wolf and Chibi for some of the for some of the people that watch us for over the year. And guy, right now, today the day. We are going to be watching Mr. Miyashi. All episode. I am so excited. Since last year, since last year when we, when we, watched, when we watched the season 2, back in February, we, it's been a while, right? And I cannot wait. We want to, of course, see the next story of the next adventure from Mr. Miyashi. Oh, what, what they have in store for the second season. But I, I'm Fabi, I'm Neo. And I dog, and I saw my combo, and I'm Shadow. I'm so neat, and I made Don out, and guy, welcome to the another day for Team Don's Not Watch Long, Try Stay, as we get ready for Miss Kobe at Dragon Me as a guy is, what it is, what are we just gonna be, we know this Sunday is Try Stay, the so guy, any thought of the Today Watch Along? I'm honestly coming to the side, man, we want to see how cool it is, I'm going to see Kobe actually tell what I'm going and we're not the mention that we are, we're going to, of course, you guys remember to actually watch along. We are going to put on um, me and new foe. So, you know what I mean? I can't wait to see uh, the new dragon. And guys, not to mention that, for some of you out there, uh, Tales on Watch Along, the first video on four, Tales on Watch Along, Take Over Tri State, called Bagan by Mad Talk. This video is out today. It's today. You heard me, guys. Today. Uh, it's, it's, we heard you. We heard you. I know. I'm excited. This video is I love this song. I'm the girl now. I'm watching this. But listen to the song. Because it's coming out today. Uh, of course, it's a club. Like always. So make sure to check out on that. And also, guys. Um, second news on for the weekend only for 3 for 3 anime weekend called Sony by you guys at 1 OK 1. So we did we, the last thing that I hear that was from the uh, our shop play, right? Well, the Sony will of course make the world will have to be here at a different time, way before, way before the like the price is gonna show up. So, I can't wait to see, I can't wait to, for you guys to watch it. Oh, Fabi, I can't wait to it, and I gotta say. Kirby really miss it out. Kirby does really miss it out. He miss out. He miss out a lot. As I mentioned, when we watched uh, Jesse the Tiger yesterday, and along with, and all along with finish up with this movie, Chibi. But guys, great movie, guy. Great movie. Honestly, highly recommended. But guys, and also we, we want to let you know this, right? We don't know of course for Tales of Watch Along Charge Day. This event is gonna be absolutely, absolutely black. We look forward to see how the event gonna go. We're not sure. We like this is that. We'll pull it out. So, well, guys, you ready? Well, guys, I, I got to admit, because let me let me just say the team that's watch on Tristar is followed by Crunchyroll. Story adventure about watching every anime, like TV series and movie. Crunchyroll, sign up for a free month trial and Amazon. Order what you need, like pharmacy, grocery, even you want to shop at home. Amazon, join today and. The Tingo Solo and Garcia are celebrating Asian American Heritage Month all month long to support the people who are Asian Pacific. Show your love at Asian Heritage Month all May long. And guys, let you know, the Team Don Sun and Tri State coming up this Sunday, even during this week, in Woolen Park, New Jersey. So make sure you guys watch it this Sunday, special time, 6 Easter, 3 Pacific, only on Team Don Sun All Star. I got I am so excited because last thing that saw last thing that saw this coming reaction was at first on the Tales I watched on Standard Level, which we watched in the OVA. But I am personally excited to see what this episode will have in store for all 13 episodes. So, guys, you guys ready? Alright, now, after all, this coming to Dragon S. Start now. Guys, Bye, like a dragon. Oh, this episode is gonna be good. Yeah, I don't need that. Uh, 
Okay, what we have in store? That was an A. Hello, Sota. Sota. Yes. Hey, oh. we're here. Huh? Oh, right. I found a day. I was feeling ready to come back. Say full gear. Shut up, baby. What's the matter? Just trying to think of a good present yeah. to make for Just Dad's day. Just watching a full gear. Dad's day. Hey, Ben, what's coming out? A talisman? It might be a little difficult, but I can do it. How well, cool. Allow like, me to help you out, Ben. No, thanks. And then also finish with Black Clover and Mary Van. This yeah. is something I have to do on my own. <sighs> anyway, that's what happened. Wow. A Father's Day present, huh? What a thoughtful little guy. Mm -hmm. I'm looking forward to seeing what he finally comes up with for me. Mm -hmm. Aren't talismans those protective charm-like things I see humans carry around a lot? You do? Can you tell if they work or not and to what extent? They don't work at all. They all go up in flames along with the humans mm. gripping them. Sounds like a first-hand testimony. You say that as if all talismans yeah. are full of crap, but they actually work quite well with proper magic. Fire. They do? What I don't get is how a talisman is supposed to show someone you appreciate their yathos. Okay, I'm confused. Which conversation are you in? Huh? You know, we're talking about Tinston. Uh, seriously? Whoa! Oh, man. How far is raining? Hmm? Oh, it's raining. Hey, raining. Oh, shut That's crazy, man. Let me see. Looks like the official ones are sold out. The ratings are so low, I can't tell if they're good. <sighs> that does it. Okay, it's coming. Thank you very much. Yeah. <sighs> Shut up. Don't we don't want Mother Day special. Not Father Day special is coming up. Yeah. Hey Shota, what's bugging you? Hmm? Um, nothing. Why do you think I'm bugged? Eh, just a feeling I get. <sighs> to be honest, I'm trying to make a talisman for a Father's Day present, but it's not going well. I see. I followed the steps written in the grimoire exactly, so I don't get why it isn't working. I want to show my father how good I am at something, but I keep messing up. I just need to hurry and become a real-life mage. Look at it like playing a game. A game? When you fight enemies that you know are a higher level, you don't exactly expect to win, right? Yeah, that's true. So, if you really want to defeat them, you should try thinking about the developers' feelings at the time. The developers? Yeah. Games don't just appear out of nowhere. They're programmed worlds, and they only operate exactly as the developers intended. So then, try to imagine what they were feeling when they designed a level. What did they want their players to do? If you can get inside that mindset, then the instructions on how to clear the game will become blatantly obvious. That's the part you always have a problem with, too. <sighs> when you're 
on the developer's side, you finance a huge pain in the A to figure out ways to mislead your players. Think like a developer. Okay. <gasps> Thank you so much. I'll go ahead and give it another try. Talk to you, talk to you the best. That there actually has to be some kind of condition required that's not written in the grimoire. Well, I don't know. Look what Never it give be. up. Oh. Alright. It's done! Look who it was! Oh! Great show to bring. How'd you do it? I thought about the person who wrote the grimoire. Do you mind looking where it was written? I thought that it was written in what we call the Dead Sea, which is below sea level. So I decided to recreate the very same environment by increasing the air pressure in my room. And that's when I discovered the secret! Kobayashi is a mountain. Uh oh. Uh oh no, what's the matter, Miss Kobayashi? Toru, I do believe I've caught a cold. Man! A cold? I've heard that phrase before, but I still don't understand. You mean dragons don't catch colds? There's no way a tiny human virus can survive inside the furnace. That is my body. Must be nice. Well, time for me to go to work. Where are you going? Uh, are you well enough to go? That's cute. Like, they never let me take off work for something as minor as my. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I pray that you won't, but I won't be able to go into work, so I need to call and let them know. Uh, oh no. Uh, well, let her know I have everything under control, and we hope she feels better. Hey, um, Mr. Takia, Miss Kobayashi just took some medicine and already fell asleep, but is there anything else I can do for her? I'm afraid I don't have much experience with sick humans, so I'm not sure what would help her most. Hmm. You could always try to shrink the germs so that they're easier to kill. I could do that, but I'd likely destroy her body in the process. Then maybe... Uh, the... Her nurse? That's right. Nurse What's it I get it now! What she needs is a healthy death! Hey, what the fuck is that? It's coming as you need me! I will do everything I can to help! I will protect her body and destroy her final enemy! So, um, is that right? What do nurses do? Oh my god! Maybe they just need something that can detoxify your insides, like charcoal or some yummy limestone. Miss oh. Kobayashi isn't a fire dragon or a brick oven for that matter. I know plenty of ways to bring about human illness, but I know nothing about curing them. You should learn to fend them off, too! All you have to do is feed her something that's easily digested, keep her head cool, and then wipe her sweat when it gets gross. Ow. Thank you. The fact that it takes three attempts to get a reasonable answer says a lot about who my friends are. I wonder what she means by easily digested. Let's see. I can digest just about anything, so it's hard to know what's good. Rice gruel? That looks like it's easy to make. We need yogurt. I think I saw Kana put some in the fridge. Udon, gelatin, bananas. Hmm. That just leaves something sweet. Oh my god! She went out of her way to make it for me, so I guess it would be rude to say it looks too weird to eat. Now it's probably not the best time to teach her the concept of foods that go well together. Oh! oh. oh. I'm so glad Next time, all you have to do is follow the recipe. <clears throat> Promise? Okay! 
Oh, this is worse why she's sweaty. It seems like you're sweating an awful lot. Would you mind if I wiped it off for you? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Oh, this is the worst part about the sit down. What is happening? Oh, my heart is racing all of a sudden. Miss Kobayashi always comes off as such a strong, reliable person. This is my first time seeing her so vulnerable. She's gonna be okay, isn't she? I've known whole villages destroyed by epidemics. I've seen entire nations wiped out by them, too. You're gonna get better. I just wish I knew for sure. I don't want anything that's precious to me destroyed. I suppose everything breaks eventually. That's especially true around me, since I can break just about anything. <laughs> All right. I'm home. Kana. Hello, Kana. Mm -hmm. Please watch over Miss Kobayashi. Mm -hmm. Whoa! There are medicines that grant immortality, but I know Miss Kobayashi would never go for those. I have to at least find something that can cure the illness she has. That might be harder to find out here, but I'll do it! Here we go! I won't let you down, Miss Kobayashi! Hang in there! better, Kobayashi! Whoa! Oh my god! Oh man, I feel so much better after some good rest. Oh. Better? Are you not well? I'll be okay after I get some medicine and some sleep for a few days. That's amazing! Hmm? Where's Toru? Oh my god, Toru! Oh. What's the matter? You look exhausted. Here you go. I searched everywhere. Um, what is that? It's medicine that's supposed to be very effective for colds. Okay, but is it safe? There's nothing weird like chicken breath is... Yeah, I love her. Hmm. Thanks, I'll try them. That's my sub. I don't, I'll just worry. Hey! Oh, oh, it's the candy shop lady! Do you know whose doll this might be? I don't. Okay. Are you and Mr. Takata together? Because it kind of looks like he's your boyfriend. Oh! Talking about, of course we're not together! Um, yes, we are. You said you wanted to go together to find the owner. That's not what she meant! Uh, let's try asking that kid, too! He's not listening. I guess she's an orphan. It's just hard to track down one specific person. Mm. Maybe they didn't forget it, but intentionally left it at the store for someone to find.
everywhere. I think we should turn it over to the police. Take it. Is there anybody else you know that you think we should ask? Uh, I brought us someone to help out. This is coming Come out. Come here, It's all. I heard what's going on. Uh, yeah, totally but I don't think there's anything I can do, Lulu. Please, if anyone can help, it's you. So this is the Kobayashi that Alulu mentioned? Yeah. She looks normal. But what's with that blonde mane behind her? Oh. She's totally chill, like she's used to all this. Does she wear that uniform every day? This woman is definitely bad news. Let's take a picture of it and post it on the internet. But you know it'd be even more helpful is if you could use your magic powers to sharpen your sense of smell. Mm. Oh. All right. <clears throat> Come here, 
I'll show you. <laughs> I'll start it with a single statement from Ella. I demand improved working conditions. What's this about? Are you hangry? This company wants too much overtime and you know it. Yeah, she's hangry. It's not that Ella's demands were unjustified. We just didn't have a say in our scheduling. Plus, our company's already made some solid improvements since its founding. It took some time, but the working conditions have improved. And compared to how things used to be, the amount of work seems like a fair exchange. I tried to explain this to her, but... You can't just give up and accept this abuse! I refuse to give in! I'm I have not really powerful why the... Surrounded by those of us who have grown accustomed to exploitative labor and living out our days aimlessly, Elma took a stand all by herself. Good luck. Oh, we're Jim back. Elma used the few moments she had in between assignments to <laughs> Emma just kidding. That's wild. I was once again astonished by how capable dragons can be. However, <laughs> you want to expand personnel. Yes. We're currently doing mid-career recruitment, and there's not a single applicant. Why is that? Because of the programming language we're expected to use at this company. Even if we hired new grads, they'd still need a training period. But they'd catch up quickly, right? Not everyone is like you. Here you go. Try again taking all that into account. The nice I finished the revision, spell is fast! <laughs> I was surprised by her speed. But it was the content that really left me shocked. The rough spots had been completely revised. None of the sections had any contradictions, and the text was organized perfectly. This is great! You mean that? Submit it to our department head right away. I'm oh. on it! Oh. Oh. It's a little girl. No. He gave her some babble about the company's income and expenditures, things programmers don't even deal with, and she couldn't fight back. I could tell she was getting emotional about it, so I hit her with one of these. Damn it! I know, it's hard. <laughs> it There's something wrong with you! We were all overwhelmed by Elma's intensity as we began reading through the latest draft. It was epic. She had listed every individual schedule in detail, oh. including bathroom breaks, midday fatigue, time away from workspaces, and even the amount of time resting their heads on their elbows or recrossing their legs. It was laid out like a curse disguised as a proposal to improve efficiency. It was a testament to our complete lack of privacy that many employees felt it would have been more humane for our boss to publish nude photos of them on the company website without their permission. How did she get all this information? According to her, I used my clairvoyance. I made my vision a thousand screen multi display. Whoa! Even her analogies were being influenced by work. She triumphantly headed to submit her proposal again. Shocking content aside, it was thorough and convincing enough to serve in negotiations. Maybe half day Fridays could be more than just a dream. Still, it could be trauma bonding, but I don't know how I'll be able to relax if I don't work at least eight hours. That's sad. However, the dream was only alive for a short time. All three of us were surprised when we were summoned by the executive director. He wasn't going to fire us, was he? We headed to his office with anxiety on our faces and terror in our hearts. Oh, no. Come in. It's us. Hey, I hear you've been very oh, kind to Shota. Oh yeah, Shota's dad! Oh, no. Shota's father. That's Shota baby's it's father. Isn't he a mage or something? Uh, did you have a look at the improvement proposal? Yes, you did a very good job on it overall. Joelma, right? Forgive me. Would you prefer priestess of the holy scenes? Oh. I'm currently an employee here, so whichever you prefer. Would you mind telling us what this is all about? Honestly, it's about the goddess Shota summoned. See, I figured if you were her friends, then I should be familiar with you too. I bet she's ruining your son's education, isn't she? What a perv. Oh, she's also oh, yeah. nice goddess. We have a rule in our family that we take responsibility for our summons. And contrary to your belief, I think the lady is good for Shota's education in many ways. Be sure to thank her when he develops a fetish for older, questionable women. All right, my friends. I think now would be a good time to discuss business, yes? Oh my god! 
That sucks. I was hoping he'd go for it. <laughs> People would complain if he did. It wouldn't be fair for only our department to improve. He at least got that portion right. Hey, I'm just glad you took the time to look it over. I noticed we've been getting yelled at time more frequently, so obviously he's taking some. That doesn't matter! It's not enough! This company is an ethical nightmare and it's up to us to turn it around! Did that come out of you? As you clutch your bag of hush money chocolates? That is that and this is this! Chocolates are low in sugar! That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> you have to that. Even after accepting his bribe, Elma refused to give up. She tried to start a labor union on site. She created a safe space for employee discussion and continued to advocate for better working conditions. What surprised me most was that Toru was healthier with that. I think it's a great plan. If everything works out, you'll be able to come home to me earlier. It all makes sense now. And if it doesn't work out, she'll burn. Back at you. Seeing rival forces cooperating for mutual benefit gave me hope that maybe it could work. However, our executive director oh was to use both logic and delusions in perfect ratios to sidestep oh. everything. <laughs> Damn it! This is so... Imagine it's a screen, bro. Emma, are you... No, I okay. I shouldn't have to work so late and always miss the limited seats! That's what this is about? She needs to read the story. Oh. I finally finished working oh, and have time to experience those limited time flavors. It's a miracle! Three of those, please. Three of them? Two, please. Uh, I'll have two. Me, fucker. Uh, actually, just one's cool. Uh, thank you, beautiful human! Mm -hmm. Okay. Bestie off ever! I'll be doing nothing but eating delicious sweets! Huh? Huh? Hello? Yeah. What are hey, you doing? We wanted so to go on a picnic, but we're not allowed to go far alone. We need an adult. Where's Miss Kobayashi? Oh, that's right. She did say they were making her work today. Oh. What about Toru? She said this letter's for you. Let's see. Kama watched a survival show, and now she wants to go to the mountains and pretend to search for food. I have to help out at the maid cafe today, so I can't go Oh, yeah, her. I forgot she's still working here. I was hoping maybe you would take her instead. <laughs> this means I do have some faith in you, so try to live up to it. Oh. You have faith in me? That condescending tone practically jumped off the page. Okay, let's go. The wilderness awaits. Yay! Good job! You did it, Connor! Okay. Oh. <laughs> I wonder if that's even like a little bit. Let's set up our tent here. Oh, God. Sorry. We ran into Shota on our way to your house, and he asked to come to the mountains with us. I'm glad he did. Uh, so what are you two going to do now? Fish! Say Vincent! Fish! 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 That takes me back. Long ago, I was the one fish. Uh. Take the Obama! <laughs> Further down. There are more fish in that area. Oh. Come for Papa. Yeah, I think that's where I live in too. Hit for what? Oh. 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 There's no way! They were just here! How did 
they all disappeared the moment it took my eyes off of the Wow, you couldn't handle taking them on a picnic? So lame. Oh, you forgot I have clairvoyance. Oh, yeah. 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 Someone just tried to hone in on us from a distant location. I'm sure it was Mukua. She does that sometimes, but I blocked yeah, it. Yeah, oh, You boys sure are silly. That's weird. Why can't I sense them? I never should have relied on you to do anything. Too bad. Too bad. Fine, chill. We followed the ley lines out here. We can just trace them again to get back. You boys. <laughs> oh! 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 That's weird. She's not here. Did she get mad and go home because we left without telling her? She might have been worried and gone out to look for us. <sighs> Damn it! Where could they be? You <laughs> poor me. So useless. <laughs> 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 Don't say mean things to me like that. <laughs> Faction Dragon, but I like your choice to rely on organic power. I'll accept in honor of that spirit just this once. You have my gratitude. Today we're here with the mobile zoo appropriately named Zoo That Goes Anywhere. Amazing. The main attraction appears to be this adorable mm -hmm. crab. Uh, we'll go I'm up here. Uh, what are you two doing here? Oh, he's here. We were able to chat with the zoo director, Mr. Miyamoto. Oh, man. It's oh, unusual shit, it's for funny. Ellen to ask Toru to go anywhere with her. Much less something as casual yeah, as doing her fight exercise bad. because she's feeling rusty. What's even weirder is that Toru seemed to genuinely accept the random invite. Maybe the tension between them is finally ironing out? 
I'm so glad they're getting along lately. Elma's really softened up. Don't be so naive. There's a reason the two of us were called here today. Why is that? Hey, began. Oh. Oh. Kobayashi, you decide when it's time for them to stop. Oh! Oh my God! That's crazy. We want to try to get y'all. This particular fight is reassuring to watch. I'll 
take you both out. Anyway, this is my first time 
exploring New York City. I usually just stay on our mansion grounds and don't go anywhere. Does this mean you're rich, Chloe? Uh, yeah, I guess. So you scream a lot? Like her? Why is she She doesn't sound very happy. She plays with me a lot, too. There are all kinds of people, huh? Hmm. Why? I'm really Ah. Was that from the... Come along. Oh, no, no. You see the, you see the spot right here? Yeah. It's like a pain. No, that scene was awful! I miss Lady Mare. Oh, I love Lady Mare! I love her! So, she's such a gentleman! Why are you down like that? No, but Lenny and Tyne did still the show. Oh, <laughs> but what's up, Miss Lenny? This is so fun! They played all day! Thanks, Kana. This is the first time I've ever had a friend to play with like uh, this! It's all such a uh, okay. What's wrong? So you okay? It's late. I have but to go home. But that building, was that from the uh, Rockefeller? Yeah. Oh, you're leaving already? That building was all Wait, it's not that dark outside yet! Hey, this is my oh, very... Oh, oh sorry. Lost. I had oh a fight with God, Kobayashi and ran away from home. But it was all because of something I did. It's my fault. I should head back now. If you got a banana fish, you know you know. Go check this out. Are you sure? Are you sure it's safe? We might watch it again. What? No? What if they're still mad when you get back? Wait, what if they won't forgive you after you apologize? Wait. Doesn't that scare you? Yes, it does. But I'm more scared of not having a home. Nowhere to go. Oh. Chloe? Come on. Let's go home. Listen. Kana, I... I can't just... Uh -oh. oh, no! Mafia! No! Shit! Chloe! 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 Chloe, we're going to go Oh my god. Chloe, she's the king now. That's it. They use a band, they use a band. Oh, not good. Oh, the film tower. Jeez, I never knew kidnapping a crafty runaway would be such a boring and easy job. I think a little punishment should liven things up. <laughs> Shut it and give me the tape. Right here, Michael. Hey, just make sure you don't damage the goods. Uh -huh. One tiny arm ain't gonna make much of a difference. Bye to you. Bye. 
they ran away. They didn't kidnap me. Did you? Yeah. I had a fight with my papa. I need to apologize. But I don't know what to say. Me neither. But... If someone's still there after things get bad... Even when you get mad at them... And say mean things like you hate them... If there's somebody who stays... I'm sure it'll be okay. Yeah. Are you ready to go home too, Kana? Yeah. Will I see you again? If you want, I'll give you my address. You have an address? Hi. Give them mine. Kana's at home. I'm gonna miss New York, man. But hey, that was a good share. Even though the, 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 the tri state is part of the. Oh, oh God, Where have you been all this time? Oh. Lady Toru! I'm so sorry. <sighs> well, I'm not the one you should be apologizing to. Mm. Kobayashi. I know you're right. Where's Kobayashi? what you're going to say when she wakes up? No idea. Miss Kobayashi said the same thing. Oh, okay. Ah! Huh? Wow! No, I don't look like a fake cat. I was watching you the whole time. No, I, I want a fake cat. I want a fake cat and love it up. There's no way! Okay, I'm heading out! Yeah, mm -hmm. so we, we use a picture for fan cab? That's what it's called, oh, fan cab.com, right? I'm on the I gotta look it up. Okay, take care. There's okay. no way! There's no way that we saw Toro. It's so hot. Oh, God, no! Oh. Hey, Kana, you're awake. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. Good morning. Kobayashi, are you off work today? Yes, good night. Good night. <laughs> I'm super busy until yesterday. Death March style? Super Death March style. Uh, I guess it's a little more forward than the main. Well, we gotta get a first summer vacation. June, July, summer, autumn. Yeah, June 7th, June 8th. Yeah, I'll push it. Next up, we have Colorado. Whoa, what's up? Hello, friends. Hello, friends here. Today we're trying to get a little bit of a little bit of a they're both working until this evening for a change. Well, that's weird. <laughs> but hey, next time next week, we're going to be so mm -hmm. I'm going to be super oh, easy. Might be a good day for you to go play with Psycho. Oh. I can't. Psycho has said she's going on a family vacation today. Damn. Looks like a boring day for you, then. It's being jam, huh? That looks tasty. Oh, so here it's over. Mm -hmm. Come on, that's over. Come on, sick. Kobayashi, right? can I have a watermelon? Huh? I haven't heard them mention watermelon. No, oh. Lady Toro bought one yesterday. Wow, you're very observant. Okay, we'll have it this afternoon. Yeah. It's hot. So hot. So hot. <laughs> Wait, is that? Oh no! <laughs> Damn. May life. May life. What are you doing? Oh my eye! Bear, are you ready for lunch? Yeah. Okay, I'll get it started. Do you think you could go downstairs and check the mailbox for me, pretty please? I know Kobayashi is like a guardian. Can we have some mini Not tomatoes? Not mom or dad, but guardian. <laughs> But it's like she's a good uh, ooh, But she's a good mom. She's oh, yeah. a good mom. Even though she's not ready to become a parent, but like they should show up. Yeah, because she's not an A, because she's like a 24 year old. Man. Wow. Airmail, huh? Airmail. I wonder if you have a new friend you said you made in New York the other day. Mm. Oh, Chloe. She says she wants to come over and play with me. Is it okay if she stays sure. for a bit? Of course. Really? 
Oh boy! Oh, I can't wait to meet him. Pizza, my guy. Yes, raw mullet is perfect. Yeah. So For sweet. Hot season. I want to try raw mullet. Yeah. Kobayashi, we don't have any more tea. Huh? I'm oh, already. Let's see. I don't make any. We only have one. We know milk. our tri state. I think oh, well. that is, of Let's course, certification. Going out? Game on. Looks like it. Game on, friends. Huh? Where's your house? Chocolate. I got it. And I'll just go and please. Yeah. I'm here. Hot. It's getting hot yeah, in here. Where are we so going? Hot, so I'm going. Let's explore. Hey, hey. Oh, wonder, wonder, wonder. Hey, and then break the horn. Here we torture. Maybe you'll find some things for your like picture diary. I can look for stuff for my research too. I hope you find Fire something amazing. Water. No way! Back like where? Um, from the other world that you might like her to cook sometime. No, 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 no. I was, a surprise. I thought Wall Legend. Before Execution Day. Why don't we do something else yeah, now? Yeah, Wall Legend. Here we torture. Yeah, Dale Dark World. Ants. Hmm? Dale Dark Survival. Final Warning. Final Warning. Final warning. Final warning. Final warning. Final warning. Oh, and right. last period of the year. I wonder if they have a little home under that manhole. Manhole? Sorry, guy. Someone need to like need to borrow something. So where are we? Oh yeah. Hmm. It's actually made for a human. The last pair of you, we was saving to tell you later on the ground here that runs all over the city. Well, before those Does that doors. mean there are more leads on the ground? Mm-hmm. Yep. Way too many, in fact. Oh. No, you know. I just realized there's a bug on top of her. Oh, yeah. Huh? Huh? Is this another research project? Over there! Oh, they always oh. You'll find a lot of them on this street. This one's the same. So they're going to name all, all the sewer names. That's for a fire hydrant. This one's similar but kind of different. Right. Kana... Kobayashi! Mm -hmm. I found another one! Mm -hmm. Great! <laughs> We saw a plushie, a, we saw a sick plushie, a oh, Kana, she, okay? she sure. said, that was great. she, she exploded. Yeah. Oh. One time, me and Kirby were walking, we just saw it explode. This is so cool. I'm just going to show you. Yes. Oh, 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 baby. Guess dragons can get a brain freeze, too. Yours looks very yummy. Do you want to try some? Yeah. Someone asked Kate Saw, which is coming out of Battleground. Oh, what her name? Cole was her name? I'm not sure what the Emma Lee is. Oh, my gosh, you look. Hmm? No, she oh. nailed it. Oh, wow. You found a colorful one. Looks interesting. Has it always been like that? It's weird that I've lived here so long. and never noticed it. Is it some kind well, of character? Well, I saw... Oh, fuck. Oh, it's a bird. Oh, it's a bird. Oh, it's a bird. Oh, it's a bird. It's so Mr. Quiet. So you recognize him. It's not like I finished the story. The mm, that's enough. Oh, it's raining. Oh, great. Random old yeah. Oh, no. Mr. Ray and he is ugly. Oh, my God. It's like sticky and muggy. Mm. Are you hanging in there, Connor? Yeah. I protected my notebook. Good for you. We may as well just go swimming now. Hey, oh, she's dry! That's pretty cool. Come in and try it all right. Well, what do you expect? Just a typical summer downpour. Typical downpour? Yeah. Rainy, rainy, rain, rain. Go away, you fucking... It's a rainy monsoon. <laughs> Stop sunning it. Out of way, thunder so strong. Sing the song. This is not good. What's up, Come on! Woo! It's quiet. It's quiet. That's what the man in the picture was on. Oh, wait a minute. She's drawing. Oh, oh caught mm -hmm. it. Poor ladybug. Oh, yeah. It must have got washed away. Is she dead? Mm. No, it's alive. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Be free, ladybug. The bird comment, ain't it? I'm sure that it's going back home. Uh, she has a home? Everyone does. Oh, oh it's not raining. I call it the heaven sky. Rainbow! Yeah, it's like heaven. Hey, 
It sure looks like one. And now the rain's completely stopped. Toro and the others should be getting home soon, too. You ready, Kana? Come on. It's time to go home. Thank you, Miss Kobayashi. Next time I want to bring a camera. You should. We're home. Welcome back. You're so late. Let's eat. I'm hungry too. Where were you two all day today? Mm, here and there. I'm so fun. Right? Something fun with the help of me? No fair. Yeah, please. Hi. Any injuries? Remember to breathe. One, two, and one. closer to geriatrics. I need to figure something out before I wind up bedridden with Toru in charge of my entire life. No! 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 Wow. I thought we just do I've never seen so many massage devices in my entire life. Cool. What's this one do? Oh, how well, specific. Uh, that one looks exciting. This might be good as well. Oh, look at that. How many species? Is that fish tail? They're so magical. Oh, my God. Miss Kobayashi, what are these? What, are you gonna do what with the hell? Use them, obviously. Are you sure about that? When was the last time you used this pink obsidian, huh? I know when I'm ready. Want me to pound you? My grandma used to Oh, yeah, I forgot that really could do that. Like this. There's a grandma. Does that feel good, Miss yeah, Kobayashi? Yeah. It's fine, I guess, but can you remove your jugs? Uh, let me try. Oh. Is this a thing now? Kobayashi, something's on my mind that I want to talk to you about. What? Mm -hmm. I spend a lot of my time thinking of all the ways I'd like to service you, but I've come to realize I'm only thinking about what I want. In order to provide the perfect service, I need to focus on your feelings and consider what it is you need most or what you would like me to do for you. Where are we going with this? I don't know. So no! No! Not again! No! Well, I thought we were done with that! I should have known your kind heart would lead you to storm instead of pierce my tail with your teeth! What I wouldn't give for you to finally accept the truth about that. Oh, yeah. Does this mean we're in a fight? Thank you for a great Oh, no! 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 I called you fools here oh, okay. since you work with Miss Kobayashi every day. Maybe don't start off by calling us fools? Her lower back is hurting her again. Now that you mention it, she has been working later than usual. Our sales team is talented, but we work harder. This isn't about her job, guys. Well, there is something else I noticed. Great, what is it? She has really bad posture in general. What does that have to do with her lower back hurting? Ah, oh, jeez. Let me break it down for you. These humans can strain their backs by hunching over their keyboards. They can? She should call oh, yeah, the I do have a video. What? She's been using the same old offensive office chair for years now. Do you not see me like the old man wanted to do it and go for the same course? She says she doesn't want to pay for one. Are they expensive? Let's get just Is Miss Kobayashi one of those humans who buy multiples of products because she thinks it makes them cheaper? Can you start with yeah, the steroids? She also buys well liquor and nurses it all night. If she would eat my tail, she wouldn't have any back pain. Whatever. <sighs> Yeah, but then her stomach would hurt. There is something yeah, I can get from our world that can help Miss Kobayashi yeah. with their lower back. I'll have to go and find it. That's, uh, maybe not a good idea. Huh? Yeah. Have you heard the story of eating the flesh of the dead? It's said if you boil the meat in a pot while visiting the underworld, you'll become permanently trapped once you consume it. You think I'm trying to trap her in our world? If you did, then Miss Kobayashi would practically be Persephone. I don't know about Persephone. She's more like King Demophon, isn't she? Man. Sometimes things just don't work out even when you know it's for the best. I think I'm going to go home and revise my strategy a bit. You got this, Mr. Takia? Thanks. Uh -huh. okay. I have to admit I'm impressed with your skills. It can be hard to talk sense into Toru sometimes. Can it? Well, it's just logic. Whenever emotions are heightened, it can be easy to overstep. I was just concerned. Mr. Takia had a good point. Honestly, that whole thing hit me kind of hard. I don't see what's wrong with maximizing your power to make someone who's precious to you happy. Isn't that what it's for? I've always thought so. But if Ms. Kobayashi doesn't want my help, I guess I should mind my own business. 
I've been eating food from this world without any concerns about if I would end up stuck here. In fact, I think I'd be fine with that. But I wouldn't want to take Miss Kobayashi away from her world. Oh, she's home. Mm. Welcome back. Hey. Oh, you decided to use that? Yeah, it actually feels pretty amazing. Miss Kobayashi. <laughs> oh. No means no, Toru. Calm down. Why don't you try resting your back against it? Oh! <sighs> Toru, where have you been all my life? Oh wow! Oh my god, look at Masacha. Yeah, it's Do you my want me to adjust anything for you? Mm -hmm. Hmm? No, this is perfectly fine. So is it everything I want? I do believe we have a winner. Hey! Well, that's easy enough. Just relax. <clears throat> I actually feel a lot better. Woo! Are we trading? Do you want me to massage you now? Oh, uh, sure. Shoulders, please. What? Why are your shoulders so tight? Is it because your boobs are heavy? Oh, wow. That's crazy! <laughs> what are you writing? It's a grimoire for perception blocking and stuff. Oh. Ah. I love convenient magic. <laughs> I was thinking of teaching Kana and Yululu how to do it first. Oh. You're a good friend to them, Toru. Oh, you don't need battery to have your way with me. Oh, you're so cute when you're shy, but you don't really need to be. Exactly. It was just a five out of the But you see how strong Yululu was? Yeah, she's strong. You better watch her boobs. I'll be perfect, but... I knew it. Anything strange about the lines of magic like spells total, and the lines of code total. and programming? That they resemble each other? Oh, sure. Yeah. There's a simple explanation for that. It's because they were originally conceptualized and developed by mages. Huh? What? Really? I didn't know that. <gasps> Are you interested no. in learning more about this side of things? Oh my god. If so, then you're probably dying to know. To know what? You've been wondering what it was that brought Toru oh to the world in the first place, have you not? I can ask Toru about that! Would you like to know anything about what her family experienced? Uh. Oh. <laughs> Toru. Yo, it's Toru Dad! Emperor Demise! Uh. Is that Toru's father? Wow, it's been a while. Well, what are you doing here? I'm visiting my friend who's in charge. Friend? He's been telling me how Toru's doing. Is that so? I assume if you've come here, that you have something to ask me, right? Yes, that's true. But, um, just know that I'll also be asking Toru for her perspective. Mm. Very well. It felt as though we would never find peace. We did a lot more than prepare for battles by gathering forces, then clashing against them and wearing ourselves out. The reason we fought was to defeat the gods and restore the world to a state that was free of any imposters. We bared our fangs because we hated the thought of being controlled, and we desperately tried to take back our freedom. At first, this turmoil is what unified all of the dragons. But as time drew on, some changed sides and supported the efforts of the gods. There were others who grew sick of the fighting and refused to lend their aid to either side. We now refer to the first group as the Harmony Faction. The others are the Spectator Faction. And because we were neither, we came to be known as the Chaos Faction. We are the ones who would plunge the world oh, into no. chaos. Our strategy was to fight for several centuries, then wait for several more to build up our strength. While all of that was happening, I had a child. Her name was Toru. She was named after an author from this world. I'm sorry, I dissociated. What did you say? Something about Toru being named for a human? That's correct. This man was here for it all. He used clairvoyance to read that book and write down the text. He then sold numerous copies of it across our world. It's called 
plagiarism, I think. The copyright of an author's works disappears a while after their death, right? So there's no harm in selling it in another world. And well before the book is even conceptualized. I can't live without funds for my research. Seriously? Humans. At that time, I just couldn't regard them with any level of importance. Occasionally, they'll create amusing knickknacks or design something entertaining. But that's all I thought they were good for. There were some among the group who worshipped the gods, even though they were nothing compared to the dragons they fought against. That's why I ignored them as long as I could. But it became a different story when those humans joined forces with the Harmony Faction. So those in the Chaos Faction began spreading the rumor humans were pure evil that we were honor-bound to destroy. Papa! Papa! What kind of creatures are humans? They're nothing but evil. They should be destroyed. I thought I had to go along with the Faction or else my Toru would be persecuted. Toru was born into the rigid structure of Dragon Society with no hope for reform in sight. And I believed that I had burdened her with a life of being my daughter. Perhaps I believed she was doomed as a member of my bloodline because of how negative the humans were. I decided to grant Toru free will over her life. I wanted her to visit many places interact with a myriad of beings, and develop her own ideas. Everything Toru has learned stemmed from an interest curated without bias. I thought she would eventually come to question the Chaos Faction, perhaps even challenge their contempt for humans. But she's completely out of control. What makes you say that? Well, for one, she stormed the gods' camp all by herself. Oh my god, yeah! It was there that she was wounded, and then somehow she was able to escape into this world. That's when I found her in the mountains. That's correct. It was quite a surprise. I never imagined such a strong bond could form between a human and a dragon. It was fascinating to see for the first time. So then, why did Toru take that risk? Her heart. More than anyone else, Toru wanted to end the fighting. If she could crush the gods, then the fighting would end. That must have been what she thought. Damn. This is intense. I know! So now you have the general overview. You'll have to ask Toru if you want to know her feelings in detail. Could you tell me one more thing? I can try. It's about when I first met Toru. She had mentioned to me she'd been recently abandoned. What do you think she meant by that? Abandoned? Well, let me think. I can hardly surmise Toru's feelings, but I'm sure from your human perspective it sounds like I'm a bad father. Actually, you're one of the better ones. Yeah. Toru was not forced into battle by any faction. Believe me, she fought completely of her own volition. Just as every single dragon did when this first started. Well, I should be going. Hmm? But I want you to know, I will never approve of you two. Uh, uh, yes, sir. It may be hard to believe in light of current events, but he's made several arrangements with God for her. Wow. One more thing. Take proper care of her until your lifespan runs out. I'll watch out for her. I promise. She wants to kill Tori. Until, until Kurashi is dead. Yo, that was crazy. If I remember the story, it was like, oh, she got okay, nice. But seeing, like, the story, you know that there's a lot more shit to go. Please, Kyoto Animation, hurry up, Mom. hurry up. Welcome back. How a was new season? season. It's been like, what, since we were Your dad showed up at my office, Toru. And like, you like, told like, me all about what happened before you came here. 
So, I was hoping to hear it from your perspective. What inspired you to move so far away from your own world? I'd appreciate it if you told me yourself. You know, whenever you feel like talking. It's cool. You don't have to force yourself. If you don't want to talk about it, I totally understand. Promise. Do you want to know? Mm-hmm. There's magic to look like a human? You did it on the first try? Oh, wow. You really are a genius, aren't you? Good job. Your father said he wants you to go to all sorts of places, wherever that may be. <laughs> I wonder, does the Emperor of Demise want his daughter to become a spectator? That was that, the day I started my journey. Humans were everywhere I went. People are so foolish. They're fighting today as well. It's a constant battle over things like land or authority. But they also create a bunch of interesting things. That was my first impression. Well, as a dragon. Oh, Kana! Why did Kalu? And Toru. Kalu? Close enough. Your name is Kana, isn't it? You use magic to become a human, too. Why? There are lots of exciting things to do with human hands. I like pranks. Hmm. Is that the previous Kama Kamui? What kind of pranks? Collecting bugs and stuff. That's not a real prank. Oh. Oh. I want attention from you. didn't have time for you while they were preparing for battle. They usually only clash once every few centuries, if at all. Oh my god! Oh god! Because you're a coward, it's a quadro. You're strong but refuse to participate in battles. I don't like to fight. What do you want from me? Looking in from the outside, it's so pointless. Tell them love. We should quit the chaos faction. The representative of the chaos faction. If I were to run, then my father's position would be in jeopardy. Absurd. If you can't live your life the way you want, then you fail as a dragon. The fact that you were put in that position by others must be aggravating. Is that how it works? You may be a dragon, but you live too selflessly. If anyone stands in the way of what you want, kill them. Even if they're your parents. That's what dragons do. Pretty extreme. Yeah. Oh, Dragon Ball. Yeah, we're gonna get Alma. Toru, uh, I can't continue on this journey with you. We have to end it. Right. No hard feelings. You do make a good point, and I understand what you mean. I guess it's possible that I've been used by others, too. I don't agree, of course. I'm not a complete fool. Prayers are precious resources, which is why I think it had felt so good to focus on helping humans. You got to eat your fill, too. <laughs> Thank you, Toru. I had such fun with you. I'm glad it was your decision to travel with me. I'll never forget.
Wait, I'll show you. Whoa! She is that strong! That was from the same That's how I remember oh my it. God. I was afraid to be free until you showed up and took my hand. You made me feel like I wasn't alone. Uh, cool. I was never interested in anything until after I moved to the big city. Give me out. I know who well, I am. Why does Kobayashi turn to dragon? Miss Kobayashi. <laughs> I see that. I've always wanted to be a maid. Oh my god, there it is! Swirly, 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 oh. swirly, too much polyglutamic oh. acid. There we go, sorry. now it's broken mm -hmm. up into glutamic acid. Destruction is the essence of dragon. <laughs> is it ready yet? Need more. Oh, hi! Come here, Shane! Morning, Kobayashi. Oh, there's a poster! Oh. Oh, crumb is so soup. Great way to kick off summer. <laughs> Thanks for the food. Take said there's something called a summer festival coming up. Oh. Sounds fun. Mm -hmm. I told Psycho I would go with her. What do you do there? I heard they open up lots and lots of stalls and stuff. Like, we're up below, like a soda pond. And that's the part we just saw at the end, at the credit. The kid. Let's do a guy. Ooh. And we're oh, back. back. Bye, guy. So. Damn, way different. Watching it all in one shot. So last year we watched it all six, and the next day the like last six. Yeah, we'll be done with Kanae, but come on. We think we jumped so far, guy. They were saying we come back with a way, and then we continue with Sartre's. A way, Sartre, D for DJ, not this. Start getting serious. Huh. Well, what do you think? Serious. I guess I just go with it. I mean, what else can you do? Yeah, I get that. I definitely get that. Hey, it's the festival they were talking about this yeah. morning. Yeah. I guess I'll go with Toru. Do we have to get Yukidas? Shake more one. I'm out. You don't have to They're decorating already? Oh, it's over! Oh. Toru? What the? Oh, man. Some people from the shopping district needed help. Wow. They really have a lot of faith in you. Yeah, remember? They well, it's a huge pain in the tail, even if it is for the festival. Oh, uh, you look like you were having so much fun. Mm -hmm. Because I knew you'd yeah. pass by at any moment. I thought of you walking yeah. under the lights. I hung up next to you. Oh, 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 oh. Magical. Hey, are you up to anything on that day? And before I can make a little bit of 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 Working with them to build genuine connections and really striving to earn their trust. I guess that's easy to do when you have the power of a dragon. Just changed, but in a good way, I think. Yeah. I haven't. I'm the same. Which makes me wonder if I'm even on her level at this point. Why does she even like me? Whatever. I guess it's silly to compare. She started bothering me less and less, and I'm feeling more and more lonely. Well, that's a thought that will never see the light of day. Ah, it's the next day. It's here. To the day. The festival. The skull. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, the Yukudu protocol. Why, can I have this one? Yeah, it's so cute. Oh, yay. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, 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 thank you. What about yours? Aren't you gonna wear one? Uh, yeah, yeah no. No. I'm actually good. Miss Kobayashi, which one of these do you like best? I don't know, whichever one you could see yourself wearing. Oh, come on, don't ruin this for me. I want you to choose, please. Uh, okay, fine. Meeny, meeny, miny, mo. I'll ask God if he knows and put a rose on your nose and take this one. This oh, one. Oh, yeah, it's better than this. Hey! I don't know if I can do anything 
Oh, uh, but look, guy. Ah, uh, on our way to a uh, party. Oh, Emma! Hey. Are you having a good time, Emma? Oh my god. I just love festivals so much. I wonder what they were like in your world. Let me think. There was whole roasted pig, a big chicken. She only remembers what kind of food she ate there. It's Lady Coro. There's this there. Our meat cafe specialty, Omo Rice. Lady Coro. Hi, Kana. Mickey, bye. Why are you wearing that festival uniform instead of your own maid outfit? The maid outfit is so hard to move around in. I figured you'd say that. What matters most is the heart. <laughs> you have all the rice, I'm over too. <laughs> Sorry, you have to go wait in line. which is why the dragons couldn't get close. Oh, yeah. In the big country up north, they held a huge festival in the spring every year. It was so hard to get through there that season. The gods actually came... Blah, blah, blah. blah. That's all I can hear. I mean, I like hearing about other worlds, but it also makes me feel kind of invisible. Oh, well, whatever. It's fine. Oh. Uh... Yay! Well, then that's it. He's the break. That's a part of that game. Thank you, Psycho. So is yours. Oh, sure. Uh, hi! Great! I'm 
was just about to look for you, Miss Kobayashi. Oh, you look good in that one. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, is everyone over there? <laughs> oh. Hey. Do you want to take a walk? Just you and me. I would love to. What's gotten into you, Miss Kobayashi? <laughs> Have you finally come to appreciate my unique and powerful charms? Mm -hmm. What? You're one of the strongest dragons, even capable of fighting the gods. But here you're able to make friends with anyone whenever you feel like it. And lately I've been wondering, after hearing everything you've been through in the past, how am I worthy of being loved by such an incredible person? You've really been thinking about that? I suppose I did share a few too many heavy stories. Here you are living with me like you never used to fear and hate humans. You must be constantly reminded of the many things you had to go through. Oh yeah, and you're also a dragon, so there's that. That's what keeps repeating in my head. So what? Anyway, I guess it's fine. Even though it's a pain in the A sometimes. <laughs> anyway, that's been my dilemma. But what about you, Toru? What's on your mind? You want to know about my feelings? Uh, well, you know I love you, Miss Kobayashi. I feel this way even though you're just a human. And even though we are better than you, better than all humans, really. I'm sure you're not surprised. I am a dragon, and I take pride in that. I've been places where you have to risk your life and put everything on the line to prove your superiority. But my heart, when it came to love, I had no idea how to prove my feelings. I wondered, would it be easier if I were a better fighter? Or smarter? I wished I could be those things. I spent so much time trying to convince everyone I was. I guess I was trying to be an adult. But I realized I didn't have to try to be anything. It was okay to just be myself. And you're the one who helped me realize that, Miss Kobayashi. You're giving me too much credit again. I think it's a good sign that you're so unaware of it yourself. Because it means you were meant to save me whether you wanted to or not. Miss Kobayashi, I love you so much! Oh, it's a firework! There we go! From this moment on, forever and ever. Don't have any future. outside all day, ma'am. What if I said I knew someone whose flesh turns into flowers? They gave me some, but it wouldn't be right to enjoy them by myself. Huh. Flesh mm. into flowers? Why not? It seems like the kind of thing you'd enjoy immensely. And I'll make sure it's the perfect day. I don't get why you're so into this. Uh, come on, everyone has something that can be healed with flowers. Oh, but for now, let me get you some more yummy soup. Introduce myself as the MC. First things first, 
Thank you all for joining us today for Miss Kobayashi's official flower viewing. We have several things to do, and they were all crafted with Miss Kobayashi in mind. Right. So lend a hand where you can and make sure that she's having the best time. I don't know what you're trying to do. Oh, oh bonfire. <laughs>
But good job, Toe. You're warm. <sighs> we got like some more left, guy. Yeah. Let's enjoy this. Tomorrow is Kinnear, right? That Kinnear. What's that guy? Emmanuel. I can just say my girl, Noriko. Yeah, main part of my poster right here. Guy, we coming for you tomorrow. Oh man. I need a Wow, you really do drink a lot, don't you, Miss Kobayashi? Why, sharing me? Oh, of course. Load me up, Captain. Well, guys, tell us where it's Primal. Uh, all you have yeah. to do is tell me you love me back. Uh, oh my god. Yeah, Toro said. Yeah. She said, I love to I, Toro. Oh no. Yes. I can't talk. Stop talking. You <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Okay, let's go back to my app, but guy, oh, what a day it's been. We got tomorrow, we're gonna watch Carnaver, and you know, Carnaver is gonna be such a banger. Oh, shut up, Tommy. But yeah, guy, Carnaver is gonna come tomorrow, and again, it's gonna be such a banger. And you know, like I said, can I say my girl, Noriko, 
But you will see some similar faces tomorrow as we're going to watch the next anime. And then on Saturday, we're going to be watching a Konami movie. And yes, on Sunday, the weekend is take over from Shadow Swan and Nadine and Bobby. And then on Monday, the Fallout Tries Day. And also, Sound of Season 1 will be there, even though Season 3, season three is still airing. But lastly, on Tuesday, with Damn Sham. I call it the Hard Soul Try Set. Our House Season 3 we will conclude the series. Hopefully, everything will be back to normal. Hopefully, Lose will find will finish the story. So, I tell that we get more, more detail on the way. And then, of course, in two more days, and in two more days, I'm from, after we're done with the, the main event with Try Set with Our House, then on Thursday and Friday, the Garcia Boy is coming back where they're going to be part of the, 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 the king of the the king of the anime where they're going to watch Tora Dawa for two days. Well, guys, that's it for today of the Tales of Watch Along Take Over Tri Stay for Miss Girl Rashi Dragon Man Ass. Tomorrow is Knaver. Hey, guys, I mean, also be sure to look at the, be sure to check out the theme song called Begging by Madcock. This is, of course, the first theme song for, for Tales of Watch Along. Take over Tri State and also for Take Over Tri State for the T Cosa event for Blue and Yellow Brand for invited to two brand coming out this Sunday. Make sure, make sure to check out the first deal so coming out to um, of course today. Only on our production. Well guys, thank you for thank you so much for watching and we see you guys tomorrow. Take care guys and we love y'all.